Hey everybody, it's Doug Carver again for another episode of Driving with Doug, uh, the walking edition. And that's because we're at the Latitude 33 development located here at 310 Washington Boulevard. It's only about two blocks from the Venice Pier in the heart of Venice, California. And typically I would hop in my car, we'd drive around the neighborhood, I'd give you a little bit of insight. But today, it doesn't make any sense to get in a car. We're gonna walk around the Washington Square area, which is the area at the end of Washington Boulevard, right at the Venice Pier. Check out what's going on at the beach today, see what's going on at the restaurants, give you a feel for what it's like to be here on a busy weekend. Uh, and then check over uh, the property. There's a great property that just came on the market in this development of about 100 units. It's a townhome style, three bedrooms, three baths. It's unit number 206, and it's listed for 1.699 million. It was built in 2010, so it's got all the upgrades and amenities that you're looking for in a property as well as some other benefits as being part of this larger development like a, a health center and all that other cool stuff. But let's get going. Let's go take a quick walk around the neighborhood and then come back and we'll check out the unit. Let's get going. And we're going to head down the street. Actually going to pass my office here on the left, which is actually in the Latitude 33 development. Uh, as you see, we're only about two and a half blocks away from the beach. Uh, so you're really, really close to all the activity, all the action. Uh, let's keep going and uh, point out some other features as we get closer to the water. As I'm walking to Venice Pier, just want to pan over here to the left real quick so you can check out the Venice Canal. This is called the Grand Canal, and it's what brings water to the Venice Canals that I'll feature in one of my upcoming uh, Driving with Doug episodes. About a block now from the beach, things are pretty hopping here. No, no surprise, it's a warm day and everyone wants to be in the water. There's lots of cool cafes down here about a block from the beach. Right next to the beach now, places are pretty busy. Everyone's got their surfboards out, enjoying the day. So I'm standing here on the end of the pier here in Venice, uh, just a glorious day. It's about 105 degrees, just a few miles inland, so it's no surprise that folks are coming out and enjoying the 80 degree weather here on the beach, surfing and just soaking up the sun. This is about two blocks, as I mentioned, from uh, Latitude 33, so in essence it's your backyard, it's where you come, you play, you hang out, and while living here in uh, Los Angeles and Venice is so much fun and such a desirable place to be. All right, we're making our way back to Latitude 33. Again, it's just a couple blocks away. Let's uh, head back over to Unit 206 and, uh, and check it out. We're just going to walk across the street here real quick and uh, check out the open house. Okay, now you get a better view of the, uh, I guess, the walkway here that uh, is where all the units face on to. Lots of mature trees, lovely landscaping. I'm gonna swing it around here and take a look inside. Hi. Hey, how are you doing today? Good, how are you? Cool, unit 206. I think we're at the right place. Awesome, but I like the openness of it. Obviously, they're using it now as a office, so, and workout room, so multi-purpose, with good views of the patio out front. Of course, you have a full bath. Of course, we have a two-car garage off the back. And uh, let's go upstairs to the main living area, which is on the second floor units. And then we're coming up to the main living area. Again, it's an open concept. So we got this real oh, lovely kitchen, huge center island, modern appliances, stainless steel, Bosch appliances, nice open ceiling, oh, open, I should say, high ceiling. It looks like it's humble about nine feet would be my guess and uh, lovely hardwood floors come around to the other side lots of light in here too i noticed with floor to ceiling windows on both sides of the unit all right very cool let's swing it around one last look and then we'll head up to the third floor and check out the uh, two other bedrooms so we have a skylight, brings in lots of natural light into the stairway area. With the third floor landing, where we have the bonus bedroom here to the left. 
We've got a lovely, good sized uh, laundry area with travertine tile floors. And these were built in 2010, so relatively new, at least by California standards. Everything looks really clean, really well maintained. Nice double vanity, uh, granite top vanity. Let's take a look at the tub. Oh, I like the high shower head. Because I can get underneath it without uh, having to get down too low. And let's go back across and take a look at the primary bedroom. Both of them have ensuite bathrooms, which is great. This one's just a little bit larger. It has the, I'd say the nicer view looking out towards the foliage and the palm trees out in the front walkway area. Two his and hers uh, walk-in closets. Wow, lots of space that goes right up to the ceiling. Pretty cool. And then we have the second walk-in closet here as well. Pretty good pretty good space for storage. And then again, another ensuite bathroom, double vanities. This one has a nice soaking tub in addition to a really good size shower. Travertine tile again on the floor. And I always like the separate uh, bathroom area. We're going to head downstairs and head on out. As I walk back to the car, I want to wrap up this episode of Driving with Doug, the walking edition here in Venice, California. Hope you liked Unit 206 of the Latitude 33 development. Uh, tell me in the comments below what you liked, what you disliked. I want to hear your feedback. And of course, if you want to join me on other Driving with Doug episodes, don't forget to, slash, to smash the subscriber button below. I've got lots of great tours coming up here in the near future that I know you're not going to want to miss. Well, thanks for sticking around, and I look forward to catching you on the next video.